All right, for the standing one leg honest hip curves, it's honest because we're just gonna really try to lock down all the other joints of the body. Encourage you to find a vertical support that you could hold on to, even if you can't get your arms around it like a door frame or something. The leg that we're concentrating on, we're gonna drive the knee up as far as we can. Swing the leg open, then pivot the heel up, trying to keep the knee up. We really have to fight through this range. Good, good, good. And then we get all the way around to the back. Here's where you have to really work at keeping your ribs and pelvis aligned. I'm gonna show the side view of this so it's easier to understand. And then once you're around the back, come back over just like you've got a barrel or fence you're trying to get your leg over. And then it, bring it back around and down. And that's one rep. If I show you the side view, here, what's really important is that we're trying to control that connection between the ribs and the pelvis. So tuck the tail under slightly, connect the ribs, hold on to your support, and try to move exclusively from the hip, especially as you come around behind here. We don't wanna arch the back that way. That movement's not coming from the hip. It's really common on that one to see people kind of leaning and twisting their body around as they're trying to do the car. So that's why we use the honest version and trying to hug nice and tight to get that isolated range of motion at your hip. So give that a try at home or at the gym.